today I'll be making Gima Alu. It's uh, something that uh, Pakistani people, Bengali and Indian people eat at home like every other day. So uh, it's a simple recipe. Um, so you, here's the ingredients. Uh, this is uh, meat. You can put beef, you can put um, mutton, uh, lamb. I'm using lamb and it's entirely up to you how much lamb to put in. Um, I've got like three, four potatoes cut up, uh, green chilies, fat ones and the uh, thin spicy ones. So I've got some ginger chopped up. And this is uh, garlic and ginger paste, which I'm going to put in there. Uh, one onion, uh, two tomatoes chopped up fresh. Uh, this is garam masala and uh, coriander, Cor fresh coriander. Uh, for the masala, is like I use I use one tablespoon, but it's up to you if you want to use more or less. It's entirely, it entirely depends on your own taste. Um, it's one tablespoon of salt, one tablespoon of uh, coriander powder, jeera, one tablespoon of coriander powder, one tablespoon of basar, one tablespoon of uh, methi powder, one tablespoon of curry powder, and one tablespoon of uh, red chili. Okay, um, I've already had the oil on, it's quite warm. So first of all, you just uh, put in onions and you just cook these till they go lightly brown. I use one onion in Smiley. Some people use more than one. It's up to them, but I prefer to use one. And the oil, it depends on how much oil, how oil, how much oil you know you would want to use. I used half a cup. It's up to you if you want to use more or less. Depends. Okay, I'm just going to wait till these go lightly go the pan and then I'll show you what to do next. So uh, the onions are brown now, so I'm just going to put in the garlic and ginger paste. You can get this from uh, local shops, then it's not hard to do. So I'm just going to let this cook for one minute so the garlic and ginger can cook. And then I'll be putting in the meat. I'm just gonna give it a minute. So you just break it open, give it a good mix. Now this will cook itself because um, the meat will release water, so it'll cook in its own water, so you don't need to put water in there or anything. So I'm just gonna put this on high and let it cook until it's, uh, till the color changes, it goes a bit dark browner. Water is dried. I've uh, cooked this for about 15 to 20 minutes. As you can see, the water has all well, it's almost all gone. So now, at this stage, you add the fresh tomatoes and the fresh ginger. Now you just cook this for about five ten minutes till the tomatoes are cooked. Right, so uh, 
the tomatoes are done a little bit. So now you're gonna add olio masala. And uh, mix that in first. And you can put in your potatoes. And you're gonna just mix this and then you're gonna put a bit of water so the potatoes can cook. And then you're gonna check it to see when the potatoes are done. Then I'll show you the next step in this way. Add some water. If you need like if you if your potatoes are bigger than mine, then you add in more water. Depends how many how big the potatoes are. If they're small, you don't need to add that much water. So now you just cover it and let it cook. Till the potato let it cook till the potatoes are done. So we're just going to check if the potatoes are done. It looks ready because the oils come on top. Let me just check with the knife. Yeah, the uh, potatoes are done. You don't want to overdo them because then they just go too much. So now I'm just going to add some garam masala. Some green chilies and the coriander. And you just want to mix this in and uh, let it cook for about one minute and then it's all ready. And you can have this with chapati or naans whatever you like or you can have it rice I'm just gonna give it a mix and you just leave it for a minute just leave it on here for one minute and then it will be ready so your kima alu are now ready uh, hope you enjoy uh, it's so well, actually well, in English is called meat and potatoes. So I hope you enjoyed this recipe and I please hope you try it at home and Please like share and subscribe my channel, please and uh, please tick, uh, tick the notification bell so you can see my upcoming videos. Thank you very much. Bye